Hello, this is Alokthon Plays, and I am here to do another Visage walkthrough because Helios unlocked a few hours ago, at least for those on PS4. Everyone has been calling this the Groot Head from Guardians of the Galaxy. I kind of like to think of it more of an Ent Head, but I guess it's just which fandom you associate with the, with the most. Here's what he looks like, they look like. Uh, with, uh, with the actual NPC. Um, I'm not quite sure what the colors do yet, so I don't know what's, uh, editable on that, but, uh, this is what Helios looks like. I like when you look at the back of, of their head, that the, that the lights whiz, cir circulate at a fair distance away from the cranium. So, as all of these uh, new vis visages work, this is a head that you have to work as, have to use as a traveler. All the helmets had to be used as an anomaly, but now we're working on traveler heads. So, I'm still using the the Mercury head on this uh, save. So let's switch over to Helios. Okay, so if we go to markings, here we have zero uh, markings, and. The primary color changes the whole freaking head. That's not too too unexpected. And the accent color looks like that changes the color of the lights that uh, circulate within the head. If you go to a black, that turns them into uh, a white. Unfortunately, those are really out of focus. Let's see what it looks like. Ah, uh, no, no, that's not what I want to do. Change my POV. There we go. I guess they're pretty out of focus unless you're really zoomed in. Okay, let's check on it more. <laughs> okay, head. So let's go to markings. Uh, this one doesn't seem to have any settings for eyes. All you get are the eye holes. But if you go into markings, that gives you these veins. Oh, I can't remember. Uh, uh, wood circles? Growth growth rings. That's what, what, what the word I'm looking for. Or the phrase I'm looking for. So the accent color changes the color of the light, in this case, and the leaves. While the secondary color, in this context, changes the color of the veins. Do we actually get a black? Eh, it's, kind of, it's kind of a gray. See how much of a... That's a fair contrast. It's awful, but it's a fair con contrast. Huh. So, while this is a very cool looking head, it doesn't have nearly as many options as I was hoping for. I kind of wish you could change the color of the leaves without changing the color of other things. I'm always trying to do this with max contrast to see what what things do. Okay, so if you have markings one, the accent color is the light and the leaves, the secondary color is the veins, and the primary color is the underskin, the bark. So, I think this is going to be a very short walkthrough, because that's what the Helios head offers us. I hope this allows you to make the decision whether you want to spend your hard-earned nanites on this head or not. Uh, and thank you for watching. You can always subscribe. I think I might even have double-digit subscribers now. A subscriber count now, which is actually, frankly, more than I ever thought I'd have. So, uh, have a great day. Thanks.